Hey guys, Eliza here. For this week's video, I'll be telling you about the time I went to go see a musical. An amazing musical, which is called Hamilton. I didn't go see it in New York. I live in Chicago. I love the Chicago cast. It was so amazing. And then I went to go see it with Wayne Brady as he was Amber. And that was just so great. First things first, it wasn't an easy process being able to get to see Hamilton because there was like this, basically, if you guys know, if you're like Hamilton fans, if you guys know the whole ham for, edu ham, there we go, I was about to say ham for ham, that's a whole different thing, the edu ham where you get, where they take sophomores in high school and they get to take them to go see Hamilton. I don't even think I worded that right. So me, I love Hamilton, but I was like, oh, okay, what? Oh, oh. <laughs> I found about it a little late, so the people who already entered had a lot more time to prepare for it. And basically, I had to come up, do the research, and get everything ready. I'm shy. I wasn't gonna rap, I wasn't gonna perform, I wasn't gonna act, no. I just wrote a simple poem about Alexander Hamilton and what he went through. I crammed so hard on that. I just, I mean, I knew a lot of it already, but I also did a lot of research, made some connections, and kind of made it into a nice little poem. Yeah, I did that, and I was surprised when I actually got accepted to see Hamilton. Now, it was a nerve-wracking experience for me because I didn't think I was going to see them because the um tickets that i got were like standby tickets so basically if the person that was originally going to go didn't go i found my way in and that's what happened and i was like wow this is crazy <laughs> but it happened it happened and i was so happy lynn manuel miranda is just such a good writer it was so brilliant the day of seeing Hamilton, I went to go see with my best friend. I'll insert a picture there somewhere. So I went to go see it with her and one of my, my world studies teachers, my favorite teacher. I went to go see it with them and like basically the other people who got like, you know, into the program. We saw the performances of the students that went. We missed our schools because the buses were late and all that jazz. <laughs> Here. The other performances were like just wonderful. It was so good. And then there was the Q and A. The Q and A part. They were all nice. Um, it was like a few of the cast members and a few of the people who like you know coordinated everything. So we had that, and it was a really good experience to ask them questions about how everything went and how they adjusted to their roles. And then came. The part where we actually got to see the musical. <laughs> I was never so ready for something in my life. Me and my best friend were just rapping Hamilton while we were walking back to the venue. We were like, I'm just alone in a place to be a two pint Sam Adams, but I'm working. It was such a good experience just, just walking in and just getting our seats. We didn't have front row seats, we had seats like it was like a balcony and we had like the first row seats in that balcony. We didn't get like front front first, first row on like the floor, but we got good seats. We could see everything. So we could see like the background, the top people, and then we get to just see the whole thing. So I like the seats that we got. We sat down, we were all jittery, we were like, ah, uh, it got dark and we were like, <gasps> Oh my god, oh my god, it's starting, it's starting. And I was so giddy because I just love Hamilton so much. I was like, yes, 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 it's happening. I was like freaking out. And then I got quiet and I was like, okay, I need to calm down. Because there's etiquette to when you go see musicals. So I calmed down and then it got dark. And then the way Brady came out and I was like, ah! And he was like, how does a past or But I was trying so hard not to like sing along because that's like one of the rules in etiquette You just can't sing along. It was not okay. The whole thing was so good to see live It's it's such a good experience like if you guys ever get the chance to see this live Then do it because Hamilton is just brilliant live the layers that 
you see and like I've only seen it once okay but I've done my research up on it to see like know the layers of the the music styles put into the characters and so much that was just like put into the production of this musical and it was just brilliant to get to see live. I wouldn't be able to choose a favorite my favorite part because it's like it's so different with like each person who puts their part into that character they're acting. Like you can see the difference between Broadway and Chicago and then the switch up between characters that they do as you know um, the people like alternate you know what I'm saying there's it's like so different it's like lovely you just get to see them put themselves into that character and make that character themselves so then like after all of that it was over I cried for a long time and so did my best friend we were crying together we saw the guy who who was like acting King George and it was on the first floor so we we're like are we able to go down there are we able to like go and like meet the people so then uh, my world studies teacher was like, yeah, come on, let's go. We'll, just, we'll say we're going to the bathroom or something. So then, like, we go downstairs with her, me and my best friend, and um, my world studies teacher. We go downstairs to the lower level, and then we, like, start walking, and then Jose Ramos, the the guy who acts as Philip Hamilton and John Lauren, like, comes out, and I'm just like, oh my gosh, yes, my son, ah, <laughs> and then... I start like freaking out I'm like oh my gosh we have to get a picture we have to get a picture so we get in line to get a picture and we just like awkwardly scoot our way over there and we're like hi and I'm like, ah! he did so good like all of them did so well that day and getting to meet him was the best he was such a sweetheart um I'll see if I can input the picture of me, my best friend, and my world studies teacher into there. It, he was just so, the sweetest. Thank you, Jose Ramos, for making my Hamilton experience even better than it possibly could have been. And all around, it was just a great experience. If you have an Eduham opportunity, or you just get the chance to see Hamilton live, or any other musical in that case, go do it because it's so such an enlightening experience to go see live if you like that kind of stuff and even if you don't and you're like going with a friend or something it can still be just as fun it's like you may get into something that you thought you wouldn't have before you know what I'm saying if you have the opportunity just do it you know it's just why not you know I'm gonna keep saying this it was just an amazing experience I'm so glad I got to meet Jose Ramos I was gonna meet everybody else but then my bus my school bus came so they picked us up and I was like wow great timing I want to say thank you to Jose Ramos again he was such a sweetheart when we met him so I'm gonna end this video before I start crying guys thank you for watching if you want more videos on me talking about my experiences I guess it's kind of like story time videos <laughs> But um, if you want more videos like that, just comment below, leave some feedback, and leave a thumbs up if you liked it. And if you liked it enough, hit the subscribe button, maybe? Love you so much. Stay awesome, stay beautiful, stay strong. I said that in the wrong order, but I'm gonna say this again. Love you guys. Bye.